Hey everyone, welcome to Synthesis Explored. In this class, we're going to be using Reason to explore different kinds of synthesis and different ways of making sounds using the synthesizers in Reason. The main things we're going to be looking at in this class are subtractive synthesis using the subtractor synth, grain table synthesis using Reason's Maelstrom synth, and then we'll be looking at Thor, which has the ability to do a bunch of different kinds of synthesis. We're going to explore FM synthesis in Thor a little bit, but we'll also be looking at what else it can do and all the capabilities of Thor. So the way that I'm going to teach this class is not to focus in on every little dial and slider and fader of every single device. What I'm going to do instead is try to give you a functional understanding of how synthesis works and the ability to learn new synthesizers as you go. So we're gonna first talk about the four basic elements of any synthesizer. And then I'm gonna show you where they are on the subtractor. And then I'll show you where they are on the Maelstrom. And then I'll show you where they are on Thor. And by the time we get to Thor, even though it looks all intimidating and scary now, once we get to it in this class, I think you'll be able to look at it and say, oh, okay, I see what's happening here. I get it, you know, like I know how synthesizers work and I can follow the signal path in this synthesizer. And I, I have a little bit to learn. Every time you look at any synthesizer, you have a little bit to learn about it. But the basics you should be able to understand just by looking at it once you know the principles of synthesis and the synthesizers that you're working with. So that's how we're gonna do this class. So it is a little bit of an exploratory view of these three reason devices. But I think you'll get a lot out of it. I think this is the best way to learn to me. This is how I learn synthesis. This is how I teach synthesis every day. We're also gonna do a few of these just preset deconstructions where we'll take one of the presets that are in Reason, that come with Reason, and so that I know you have them. And then we're just gonna walk through them and kind of pick the sound apart and say, how does this work? How are they getting that sound? How is it getting this other sound? So we'll really be able to analyze how the synth is working based on what we know about synthesis. That's the goal. We're gonna have a lot of fun. I hope you decide to join us. We'll see you on the inside.